Fitz Franklin Coming over to play Growing a little Every day Here he comes with all his friends They've got stories, got time to Come in your house Hey, it's Franklin Come into my house Hey, it's Franklin Finders keepers for Franklin Franklin could count by twos and tie his shoes he was also good at seeing things that others missed. And one day, Franklin found something special. Franklin, are you ready to play? Yep, ready, Beaver. It's Beaver into her stretch. She checks the rudders and... Ugh. Oops. It's okay, I'll get it. Hmm, that's funny. What you find, Franklin? It's a camera. Neat. I'll take your picture. No, Beaver. It's not our camera. No, it's yours. You found it. Finders keepers. Nah, it's not mine. But that's the law. If you find something, you get to keep it. Everyone knows that. Look, Franklin, someone's already taken a picture. Take one of me! Cheese! Okay, maybe one. <laughs> Take another! One more! You okay? <laughs> yeah. Take another picture. Uh-oh. Looks like that was the last one. Great. So when can I see the pictures? I don't know. Well, you just make sure you show them to me first. <laughs> that was fun. See you. Yeah. Finders keepers. Mm. <laughs> hey, Bear, having a snack before lunch? Hi, Franklin. Just snacking on a few berries. Only a few. A few hundred is more like it. <laughs> a camera? Neat. I found it. Finders keepers. I'm not sure. What do you mean you're not sure? I just know that if it were my camera, I'd be trying to find it. And if I couldn't find it because you had it, you'd be mad. No finders keepers? Maybe I should put it back? Then whoever lost it can find it. Uh-oh. What's wrong, Franklin? I've used up all the film. What'll I do? I know. Why don't you buy some new film? That's a great idea, Bear. Hi, Franklin. What were you doing in Photoshop? I had to buy a new roll of film and get another developed. Neat camera. Want to trade it for my soccer ball? Nah, it's not mine. I found it. Well, if you found it, then it is yours. Finders keepers. Nope. I'm gonna put it back in the park where I found it. Don't do that. What if it gets stepped on or something? You shouldn't be so careless with your things. I take good care of my soccer ball, see? Yeah, and I take care of my things. But the camera's not mine, remember? Well, whoever lost it sure wasn't taking care of it. I guess, but now they're probably looking for it. 
If they were that careless, why would they even try to look for it? Well, I would. And that's why you should keep it, right? Right. Franklin and me against you two! Shot, Beaver. That's three to two for you guys. Look what I found! Look, look! Hey, guys! I found a camera! That's Franklin's Fighters camera. Fighters keepers. Franklin should return it. But I found it last. It's mine! It's not. It's two. Goose, that camera belongs to Franklin. Oh, all right. Hey, uh-oh, my camera's gonna get wet. Bye, guys. Bye. See ya tomorrow. Hey, Sam, come here, boy. I'll take your picture. Where are you, boy? Come here, Sam. Sam? It's raining cats and dogs. Mom? Franklin, is the storm bothering you? Yeah, especially because I don't have Sam. He's lost, Dad. I left him in the park. We gotta go get him. Don't worry, Franklin. Sam's a smart dog. He'll be fine until morning. But he's all alone in the dark and the rain. Please. Sam will be fine. If your father doesn't find him, I'm sure someone else will. That's what I'm afraid of. Finders keepers. Are you sure you checked everywhere, Dad? I'm sure, Franklin. <laughs> Hi, Mr. Turtle. Bless you, Mr. Turtle. Thank you, Rabbit. Hello, Beaver. What you doing, Franklin? I lost Sam. You did? What if somebody found him? What about Finder's Keepers? I know. I'm sure whoever found him will give him back. You really think so? Uh... Maybe. But if someone finds Sam, how will they know he's yours? I think I know how. If we put up these signs, somebody is sure to call. Hey, you could offer a reward. Someone will call for sure. Franklin, Bear's on the phone. Mom, I'm busy. Tell him I'll call later. You've done all that you can, Franklin. I'm sure whoever found Sam will call. Hello? Sorry, Bear. Can't talk. Sam's lost, and whoever found him might phone. Bye. Hello? Not now, Bear. This is an emergency. It just takes time, Franklin. Yeah, but maybe somebody has found Sam and they're not calling because... Sam! Hi, Franklin. Oh, hi. Boy, I tried phoning you three times today. Sorry, Bear, but Sam's lost. No, he isn't. He isn't? Nope. We all ran when it started to rain. 
When I saw Sam, everyone was gone, so I took him home with me. I tried to phone you. I know. Thanks, Bear. That's okay. And I won't finders keepers you. And no more finders keepers for me either. I'm not keeping the camera. Camera? Oops. So that's the whole story. But I forgot all about the camera when I lost Sam. I bet whoever lost the camera really misses it. Just like I missed Sam. Well, what do you plan to do now, Franklin? Find out who owns the camera so I can give it back. How are you going to do that? By putting up posters. Or maybe you could take the camera to the lost and found. Yeah, we can go to the police station. Neat. <laughs> we might not have to resort to all that, boys. Do you know who owns it, Dad? No, but I think I know how we can find out. You said there was a picture taken when you found the camera. Well... <laughs> Look, Dad, the camera belongs to the raccoon family. They'll be glad to get the camera back. Yeah, but not as happy as I was when you brought Sam back. Thanks, Bear. Franklin's new friend. Franklin could count by tunes and tie his shoes. He had the same friends ever since he could remember. Franklin never thought about making friends until a new family moved in. As we were discussing yesterday, does anyone have any ideas about how our class can raise some money for a few new books? Yes, Beaver? We've already decided ourselves, Mr. Owl. We'd like to have a bake sale. That's a wonderful idea, Beaver. But no fly cookies, please. Aw, <laughs> <laughs> uh, no one ever buys them anyway. Well then, who'd like to be in charge of making posters for the bake sale? I would, Mr. Owl, I would. I have a whole new box of pencil crayons I got for my birthday. Then you're all set. Well, that's it for today. Class dismissed. Yay! <laughs> First one out. Race it home. <laughs> hey, Franklin, want to have a snack at my house? That big sale idea made me hungry. Not today, Bear. I have to go home and start planning my poster. Hey, wait for me. I'm going to draw the best poster ever, Sam. Hey. Someone new is moving in. I wonder who it could be. Whoa! That lamp's as tall as a tree. And look, Sam, that bed. It looks like it was made for giants. <gasps> a moose family. A moose family, Mom. I've never seen a moose before. They're huge, huge. Even the small one is huge. That's nice. Maybe I'll make a new friend. No, I don't think so. I've got lots of old friends, and I don't think I need a new one, especially a big one like that. Now, Franklin, I expect you to be nice when you meet someone new. Aw, oh, Mom! Franklin? Okay. But they're still huge. Boys and girls, I want you to give a warm welcome to your new classmate, Moose. Hello, Hello Moose. Moose. Hello. Moose and his family have moved here from far away. He doesn't sound very friendly. He looks even bigger indoors. Franklin, I'd like you to be Moose's class buddy. Help him to get to know everyone. But, but... Good. Now, how are things going with the bake sale preparations? Everyone's moms and dads are collecting their best recipes for cakes 
and cookies and cookies and blueberry cupcakes and blueberry cupcakes. Excellent. And your poster, Franklin? Any ideas? A few, I guess. I tried until bedtime last night. Well, you can have some class time after lunch to work on it if you like. Thanks, Mr. Owl. I brought my pencil crayons. Oh, boy, recess! Yippee! Yay! <laughs> Franklin, aren't you forgetting something? Your class buddy. Do you want to play, Moose? No. Okay. Uh, you run along, too. Get some fresh air. Over to me! Over to me! I'm in the clear! Goose! Ah! Chicken! Fowl! Oh, great. Bear kicked it. He can get it. Hey, look! Wow! Look what your buddy did, Franklin. Thanks, Moose. <laughs> that was great. Hooray! <laughs> yeah! I guess. <laughs> Phew. All right, Franklin, we have a little time left. Feel like working on your poster? Sure! Whoa! Oops, sorry. And perhaps your buddy Moose can help. Moose? I like to draw. But I can do it by myself, Mr. Owl. I don't need any help. <sighs> do you want to help me, Moose? Uh-huh. What's wrong? Nothing. You don't look nearly as big when you're sitting down. Really? Thanks. Now, please try to remember they go back in that order, light to dark. And be careful, I keep them very sharp. That looks good. But I want to draw a big cupcake, too, and there's nowhere to put it. Maybe if you moved some of those cookies over, the cupcake would fit. Class dismissed. See you. <laughs> Who's picking berries on the way home? Right, you. I brought my bike. <laughs> hey, wait for me. Maybe if I make them smaller. No one will see them from far away. But if you move the cookies and turn the cake piece around just a, just a little bit, like this. <gasps> Moose! I'm sorry. I, I, I didn't mean to. The purple one was my favorite. Moose! What happened, Franklin? Moose broke my purple pencil. And you're upset with him? Of course, perfectly understandable, but try to imagine how he feels. He's probably sorry he broke it. Most certainly. And because he's new to our class, he's probably scared. How can someone as big as Moose be scared of anything? Good question. You see, big or little, we all get scared sometimes. Even Moose. Okay now, off with you or you'll miss your bus. Neat. Wonder who did it. Hey guys, what are you looking at? Did you do this, Franklin? It's really good. The cupcake does fit. That's what he was trying to show me. Who is trying to show you? Someone who also likes to draw. And someone who always has his drawing tools with him. That's you, isn't it? Not this time. <laughs>
You must be Franklin. Uh-huh. Moose has told me a lot about you. Uh-huh. You're a very good artist. And so is Moose. I came to see if, well, if Moose would like to work on my, I mean, our poster together. Hello, Moose. Please come in, Franklin. You're just in time. I'm trying out a new recipe for the bake sale. I need cookie testers. That's great, Moose. I can color the cherry red and the icing purple. Purple icing? Like I said, purple is my favorite color. Cookies are ready. Race ya. <laughs> <laughs> Boy, your poster sure turned out nice, Franklin. Our poster, Moose. I've never had purple icing, but it sure looks good. I think Bear wants to buy the whole bake sale. <laughs> That's Bear. Well, boys, we're well on our way to making enough money for several new books. The bake sale is a roaring success. A splendid job by all. But I must say, your poster takes the cake. <laughs> Someone even bought my fly cookies. Mmm, raisins. I love them. <laughs> <laughs> now that one, I think, should go on there. That's perfect. Oh boy, recess. Gee, you guys are always together. Don't worry, Bear. You'll always be my best friend. But Moose is my best new friend. Come on!